Hello and welcome to a new video. In this episode I'll be unboxing this new order I got from Amazon. So, um, I have crossed out all my personal information, so I don't want you coming around to my house and stalking me. So, I've got my knife here, now let's open up the box. I do know what this is, because, um, I've only ordered one thing on Amazon, so let's go ahead and open this. So, um, before I open it, I'd just like to say thank you for all your subscribers and all the support you've been giving me and all the views that I've got on my videos. So, um, let's start with this unboxing. So, there's, there's this just stupid voucher that you always get on Amazon. So, I really like the packaging for Amazon. It's a really solid, like, packaging that protects your item or items so well. So I'll start off with the smaller items that I've ordered. So um, I also ordered this from Amazon. Uh, let's just go ahead and open it. So let's just go ahead and move the box out the way for now and open this package. So um, in here I have ordered some pouches. Now you might be able to guess what the big item is in the box but I have ordered a uh, three mag pouch a set of three mag pouches uh, with molly webbing on the back uh, these are really uh, good pouches because uh, if you don't want these flappy bits and you want to open mags you can just undo the velcro and um, you have an open pouch and you can uh, keep these in your utility pouch or just keep them at home if you don't want to use them or you can velcro them back into your pouch so um, let's just go ahead and put that over there so I've got a three mag pouches I've also gone ahead and got a utility, pa utility pouch this is good for storing your BBs maybe batteries or a spare GoPro battery or whatever you use or even just snacks or food or drinks for the field. So let's just go ahead and put that there. And also I have got an admin pouch. This um, is very useful because you can put your pouch um, patches, your name, your uh, team patch. And also it has two big main pockets where you can put your mobile phone, cash, even maps. Uh, anything you need in there and also it comes with this nice pistol magazine or I like to I, I'm going to use it for a speed loader magazine uh, pouch so um, they are the three small items I bought for the item that's in the big box over there so you probably guessed what the item is over there but these are the three pouches so let's just go ahead and put them over there so um in this box, I also ordered a um, magazine. This is a 350 round high cap that I ordered from Amazon as well. This is a G&G um, magazine, as you can see down there. I don't know if the camera will focus. Come on camera, I know you can focus. Inside. Come on, camera. Anyway, it says uh, GNG armament, uh, GNG armament parts and accessories with the GNG badge right there. Um, so that is my 350 round high cap magazine that I'm going to use for my GNG CM16 Mod Zero. I have done a review on that gun. Uh, that will be up here in the screen. So just click on that link up there. So that is another mag for my gun. So let's just go ahead and place that over there. So this is the main item. Let's slowly remove the packaging. And as you guessed already, it is a vest. Um, I've heard really good reviews from, from, from this vest. It's, um, I've also heard it can be a plate carrier as well. So um, let's go ahead and open this. Very nicely packaged by Amazon and the seller. 
So, let's get it out of this bag. Oh, that feels so nice. The quality is amazing. You can tell straight away that these Molly um, loops are really strong, that they won't fail on you. So, that is my vest. I'm not sure what make it's by, but I'll leave a link in the um, description from where I bought it. Let's just go ahead and move all the boxes and packaging out of the way. Okay, so let me just zoom out a bit for you. Okay, so as you can see, I've got a tactical vest in, o vest in OD green. I've got a 350 round uh, high cap magazine for my GMG CM60 Mod Zero that I will be putting in those patches there. Uh, so I've got I've got three magazine pouch that will be going there. I've got an admin pouch. Oops. Got an admin pouch here that will be going right there. And I've got a utility pouch that will either be going on the side there or on the back that I can store my phone, um, keys, money, uh, snacks for the field, anything like that. So um, about the vest, let's just go ahead, uh, go ahead and move these pouches out of the way. So as you can see everything is in OD green to match my vest and my clothing. So um, to get uh, to open out this vest all you need to do is open these side bits here and also do the same on the other side. So now it can open out like that so you can place that over your head. Um, so I'll show you how to take out the uh, foam plates are already in these. Um, these are not the dummy plates that you can buy. These are just uh, uh, thin foam plates that uh, are already in the plate carrier. So all you need to do is undo this velcro at the bottom and then you'll see this little black pouch that is sewn onto the inside of your vest. All you need to do is undo that little pouch and you can slide out the foam um, insert. As you can see, this is just a thin um, foam plate. It's definitely not um, the proper one, but you can buy proper um, dummy plates where they're a bit thicker and they're stronger plastic and obviously they're not bulletproof, they're not ballistic or anything like that, or Kevlar. They're just um, thicker versions of these. But this is nice just to keep the uh, vest together and to keep it uh, rigid, rigidly. I'm not sure what word to use there, but just to keep it together and make it more strong, basically. So let's go ahead and put that back in the vest. So it just uses Velcro to attach the bottom. It's very strong Velcro, so you don't need to worry about them dropping out. Um, so. It does have the same plate on the front, and it had lots and lots of molly. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows of molly down the front, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight rows of molly down the back. So to attach this round your body, all you need to do is just attach these two Velcro parts at the side, and then you can use these um, plastic clips to attach. Uh, at the sides as well, just to keep us strong and together so it won't uh, fall out and collapse on you. Okay, so um, this is the front of the vest. Uh, you can also adjust it uh, at the top here and also there. And you can also adjust it on the side there and there. So um, I'll go ahead and put the pouches on and also I'll show you how to attach the molly pouches onto the molly vest. Okay for this case I'll be attaching these mag cases onto the bottom of the vest right there. So I'll be teaching you how to use these molly straps and to attach it to the molly webbing. So all you want to do is find out where you want to place your uh, pouch. So I want to place mine in the middle of the vest right there. So all you want to do is take these straps that are on the pouch and um, thread it through the molly webbing right there. So that will be the top uh, part of the webbing. 
And then what you want to do is just go along with all the straps and thread them through all the molly webbing. So I'll just go ahead and do that. So as you can see I've gone ahead and threaded them through the first row of molly webbing. Then what you want to do is go back onto your pouch and thread them through the first or the top threading on the pouch like that and just go ahead and do that with all the straps so once you've done that you can then bend it down and uh, pull these straps through and attach them to the third row of molly webbing down from where you started so I don't know if you can see that but I have threaded them through the bottom uh, the top layer of the molly webbing on the vest, the first molly webbing on the pouches and then through the third molly webbing down on the vest. Then what you simply want to do is just clip up all the um, straps onto the pouch to hold it firmly down and then in a minute you will be able to see that the pouches will not fall off or move at all. So as you can see I've attached all the pouches to the vest and if you can see at the bottom there uh, I've attached the first strap to the first uh, clip and the same with all the rest of the three clips. So now you can even hold the vest by the pouches and they will not fall off so it's a sturdy platform to put your mags. What people might cheat by is by doing this where you just thread it straight through the pou um, molly webbing it does provide a strong firm grip to the vest but it will make it where the um, middle of the pouches will be able to flop around as shown here. So as you can see here this is how some people may tell you to do it where you go through the first molly webbing and then you can either skip out the second or go through there and then go to the third but then when you attach that the middle of the pouches will be able to bend and flop about so unless if you want a quick way of doing it or it's something just like an admin pouch where it doesn't really matter uh, you can attach it like that but if it's something like a mag pouch you want it to be firm and stable to your vest so when you're pulling the magazine out of the pouch it's a strong grip and it doesn't take the pouches with it so um, that is not how you want to do it so um, thanks for watching this uh, unboxing of this vest I'll just get a view of all the items that came that I ordered. So I will be putting all these patches on my vest and um, this along with my Magpul magazine with the range plate at the bottom there. So that will also be going in these pouches like that and I will be removing these straps because so once again to remove these straps you just take out the back and you can see there you might be able to see that there's some velcro so you just undo that velcro and simply out come the uh, flaps from the pouches so now it is an open pouch where you can place your mags so uh, I like it like this because then you can quickly get to your magazine pouch, uh, magazine. so those will be going in there I'll be putting my admin pouch uh, up top there to keep my phone and a speed loader and also um, I'm not sure where to put this and also this has uh, molly webbing on the front there so you could put um, a velcro patch on there to then put your uh, team name, your name, your patch, logo whatever you want on there so that will either be going on the side there or around the back so um, I will be upgrading this vest to better um, pouches, more pouches, better pou uh, patches, so name patches, stuff like that. So you can see an up uh, update of that in a few months or a few weeks. So thanks for watching this unboxing. If you enjoyed it, please like. If you have this vest or you know uh, any good pouches, pouches, sorry, you think I should get, just comment down below and then. Uh, I'll try and read every comment you write me. So thanks for watching. This has been Airsoft UK TV. Goodbye.